Um, hi guys. This is a Jogas YouTube video tutorial on how to get a um to how to add photos on your iPod Touch. Okay, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go down to the iTunes, click on iTunes, and you know your normal iTunes will pop up. As you can see, there's an iPod Touch. There's everything. It's just iTunes. So up here. It should be summary, music, movies, TV shows, podcasts, photos, info, and applications. What you're going to do is you're going to click on photos. And right now, what will happen is you can select albums. So what you do, you have albums in iPhoto. See, those are all the albums right here. Okay. So it will be all the albums you have in iPhoto. Now I have my iTouch pictures, which I made a separate album and put all and put all the pictures I want on that album, so I won't have any of this. And so I click that, and then you click sync photos from, and then that, and then you click sync. Okay, it's sync. It's complete. And now when you open up your I touch. You should be able to click on photos and then I touch pictures should um be able to be there. Whatever you want to name it, it'll come up what the name of the folder is. Okay, um I'm just gonna show you how it looks from my iPod touch and I'll be right back. Okay guys, I'm back. Um so what you wanna do is after your iPod is so after you sync your iPod, you're going to want to turn it on. And then, when it's open, just press Photos down here. And the name of the folder you saved it to should be here on a separate album. I saved mine to iTouch Pics, so I'm going to click that one. With 26 fo photos, and here you go. These are all of the photos. And I'm just going to click on a photo, for example. This is a photo of Snoopy. You can't get this photo online. You can get the same photo, but I photoshopped it and gave a little bit of an effect right here. And watch. Tap the screen. Press the box with the arrow, similar to the video of how to get a custom background that I made earlier. You could use it as wallpaper, you can email the photo, you could assign to a contact, and you can send to mobile me. Say you like the photo, you want to make that a wallpaper, so you could even use this as a wallpaper, so press use as wallpaper. You can move to scale if you want it up there, but I'm trying to center mine. Set wallpaper, and look at that, you even got it set as a wallpaper. I mean, it's just... It's really awesome what you can do. Okay, well now you know how to put photos on your iPod Touch. Okay, this has been a Joe Gas YouTube video tutorial, and I hope you find it helpful. Um, if you're interested in getting your own custom background, check on my more recent video before this one on how to get a custom background. Alright, have a good day, and I hope you found this useful for you. Hey guys, I just wanted to say thanks for watching, and I'm sorry about the text in the computer screen video. If you watch my new one that I'm going to make, it hopefully it's not going to be there because I'm going to get the full version of I Show You. Uh, thanks for watching.